garden flowers sweet scent is strong based on how you treat them morning sun feeding what was needed summer rain feeding what was seeded so shine 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 on me rain rain until you see what you're gonna give is what you're gonna get dancing in the sunlight until you get wet life is like an ocean big and blue no matter how hard you look you still can't see what's under you just like life, the ocean wide You're sitting still, you still can't see inside Come on now, shine, shine, shine on me Rain, rain, until you see what you're gonna give So what you're gonna get, dancing in the sunlight until you get wet Shine, shine, shine on me, rain, rain, until you see what you're gonna give is what you're gonna get, dancing in the sunlight until you get wet. Ooh, shine, shine, shine on me. I say, ooh. I say, shine. How's it, guys? I am We'd All Be Happy. My name is Ray, and we are here at the Bathurst Agricultural Show 2022 at the Cannabis Hall. And today we are blessed. Um, tell me, what is your name, who you are? Tell me all about you. I'm so excited. Oh, I can't wait to hear about it. Okay, well, I'm Joanne. I'm from Hugsback. Um, I've got a, a little business there, Canacopia. Um, and I've come through for the day to check it out and very excited that we are doing this, these 420 events in the Eastern Cape. Um, yeah, the movement is nice. It's nice when, yeah. you, when you get people together and the community is growing yeah. and the right people together is also so helpful. So tell me about Canatopia. What, what, what inspired that? It's Canatopia. God, <laughs> you see, I'm already in heaven. <laughs> Canatopia. Um, well, you know, after the 2018 um, Concord ruling, I, I got in my head that I wanted to work in the cannabis industry. I've always wanted to work in the cannabis industry. So. Um, I thought, well, let me open a little shpi. And um, so it took me about two years to get my arse in here. And I opened Canacopia in December for the month of December. And it went very well. But then I closed in January because I didn't have the space for, for long term. And I reopened at the beginning of March. And it's, it's going... It's been booming ever since. Swimming. It's fantastic. So is it your, you're only based in, in Hogsback at the moment? First base? Yeah. Um, I'm busy with my website and my online shop. And hopefully I'll launch it within the next month. And then you can order from my website all CBD products. Um, so my shop stocks CBD products from CBD oils for sleep, anxiety, depression, um, energy focus, all those kinds of things. And I've also got the CBD products for animals. And I've got some smoking gear, some books. Um, at Home with Cannabis is one of them, by Kevin Q. And then we've also got Cannabis is the Human Companion Plant by ah, Sister. I've heard about that. Yeah. It's fantastic. It's fantastic. It blew my mind. No, no, I've actually got a copy and something I'm, I'm busy planning on reading because it does look pretty amazing. Yeah. Oh, that's awesome. So how do people, do you have an Instagram page? How do people get hold of you? I've got a Facebook page at the moment. I'm not big on Instagram. Um, I've got a couple of other pages on Instagram that I'm running as well and kind of trying to run them all at once. Um, but yeah, maybe in the future I'll get on to that. But you can find me on, on Facebook, Canopopia. Oh, you can visit her uh, in Hogsback. Yeah. If you've never been to Hogsback, it's definitely for, for, uh, worth, worth visiting. <laughs> oh man, thank you so much for your time. I really appreciate it. Do you have a message for the world out there on, on cannabis and their views? Well, um, I think that, you know, I started I started playing around, but I've always been a smoker, so I've always smoked weed, and um, that's the fun and all, but about three years ago, I started to um, grow CBD weed, 
and not thinking because it's got no THC in it, it can't make you high. Um, and now that I've been growing it and using it, I've got a new respect for CBD. So people should not discount CBD. It's got so much, so much health values and um, so much value in the entire plot. So yeah. Just because it doesn't make you fly, you've got to ask yourself, what other good things does it give you? For sure. No, that's great. Good stuff. Lies. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you. And we Thanks hope to see you me. next year. Yeah, for sure. That'll be amazing. Thank you. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers.